Welcome to Power Journeys with Aaron Bionic Brown, Para Athlete. Hi, I'm Aaron, a short, blonde haired black female. My pronouns are she and her, and I self identify as a limb difference individual, also known as an above the knee amputee. Power Journeys is designed to discuss adaptive athletes' journeys from start to finish. And today, during April, Limb Loss and Limb Difference Month, we have a special guest from Stride Prosthetics joining us to talk about prosthetics. Hi, Susanna, how are you? Hi, Erin, I'm doing wonderful, and how are you today? I am great. I'm so glad that you were able to take a moment. I have an opportunity to share with us. Introduce yourself. Let us know who you are, where you're located, and Stride Prosthetics. Tell us about it. So my name is Suzanne Watts, and I'm a Barbadian. I'm from Barbados, and I have established a prosthetics company here to not only service Barbados, but to serve the Caribbean. It's called, as you would have said, Stride Prosthetics, and our goal is to provide high-quality prosthetics for above and below knee amputees. And one of our main goals here, Eric, apart from providing a prosthetic product, is to empower amputees and also to educate society. Because, you know, persons hear of or may know of someone that may have lost a limb, but they don't understand what their lifestyle is like, how they um, need, you know, certain adaptations and how necessary a prosthetic is. Some insurance companies are, are saying that, you know, you're not going to cover this because it's cosmetic. Cosmetic? It can't be cosmetic if it's going to help you to be functional. So, you know, those are the things we want to, we want to factor out all those things and make sure persons understand what prosthetics are and how vital it is to functionality. And for a, a, a person who has sustained an amputation or who has a limb difference, how vital it is for them to have a good quality of life. Of about um, Stride Prosthetics, they have a system already in place. I think it's the right fit, the, the right fit right now. What's the name of that product? Right, so we have the iFit Prosthetics and we are actually the, the regional, Car Caribbean regional distributors of the product. So it is an American made, new innovative product. And what it does is different from the conventional prosthetics where, you know, you do what you take a mold of the residual limb and actually make the prosthetics custom for the individual. It's actually uh, more of a, an adjustable system. So the iFit um, stands for Immediate Fit Adjustable Technology. So actually, yeah, it is adjustable. So daily you're able to achieve the right fit of your prosthetics. Make sure that it's nice and snug. You don't have it eliminates having to do sock management because you know sock management is one of those tricky things where persons, you know, may not be wearing enough socks, so then they get bruising and rubbing on the sun, and that's an absolute no-no. So it's manageable, um, it's self-adjustable, and for persons who may not be in Barbados that may want to acquire the product, we can do this, we can do the adjustments online. Listen, you said the right word, immediate, right now, you know we like that, right? <laughs> I can't leave without talking about Antoine, who is a para swimmer in Barbados, who represent Barbados in Tokyo of last year. Like that was amazing to meet him virtually. I can't wait to meet him in person. And he currently used Stride Prosthetics products, right? Yes, he is um, our patient from his, um, even before his amputation, I would have met him. So I did, I was able to do the pre-amputation consultation with him to allow him to know, you know, like this fight was gonna happen. Uh, what you're gonna, you know, be faced with. You can still have an active life. You can still be, because at the time he was a teenager, you know, still be a teenager with full of joy and excitement. And so actually even Antoine getting into swimming, I actually kind of helped orchestrate that. I got a call from the Paralympic Association and they were looking for persons to actually get involved in swimming. I was like, okay. And I was like, I have a few people for you. Because as I said, empowerment is key. So when I called, I spoke to his mom, I was like, um, I know, I was like, you know, I want to get Antoine to swimming so he can go to primary. She was like, swimming? Antoine doesn't even know how to swim, even with two legs. 
I was like, don't worry about it. And so here you go. He, he represented Barbados at Tokyo last year, and it was amazing. Actually, he's preparing now to go to Commonwealth Games this year. So he's doing really great. And I would like to add Aaron. He's one of our newest members on our team here at Shrike Prosthetics. He is working in the lab along with me to help to meet the prosthetics itself. He's very enthusiastic and he's a wonderful young gentleman. It's a joy to have him a part of the team. This is what we're talking about. Oh, Suzanne, thank you so much. And you see why the Bahamas Paralympic is coming to the Bahamas. Empowerment may start through sports, but it overspills into so many other areas that are sustainable, that are innovative, and that ensures that all of our people are thriving in what they love to do. So Suzanne, where can we find you? You can follow us on Instagram. We have um, at Loving My Stride on Instagram, as well as on Facebook. And you can check out our website on our website, um, which is www.strideprosthetics.org. You can see our products. You can get patient testimony. We have videos on there of our patients walking in both custom-made prosthetics as well as the iFit adjustable technology. So you can check us out there. You can call us if you wish. The number is area code 246-622-1847. And all the information is on our Instagram as well as on our Facebook. There you have it. Power Journeys with Aaron Bionic Brown and Stride Prosthetics. We want to leave you with an affirmation on the wall behind Suzanne. Go forth in stride, knowing that we can restore any passion for living. Join us next time when we find out more about Stride Prosthetics Walk Proud Again Foundation.